ZSK TA2 controller. This video is intended to be a reference guide. Today I will show you how to range a design. I've already loaded my design into the machine. I will come down here and hit the design range button. You notice there is now a gold border around the design itself. Now I can contour a range finer, or trace it finer, however it takes quite a bit of time. So if you need to do that, certainly hit the contour finer button. It will actually go almost all the way down to the design how it was digitized. For all my practical purposes, I just need to be seeing a square just so I know the borders, the top and the bottom borders of the design. I am now ready actually to contour the design. I will show you now on the hoop. As I look at the hoop, we'll bring it down here. You'll notice now I have the hoop and I am going to press the green button and by doing that you will see the machine move and it will trace the four corners to make sure it fits inside of the frame and it looks pretty good and I'm confident. The first time I do this, I do this with the needle up. I will now do the same trace with the needle down which I have in position number one is what I have selected so I will put the needle down. I'm also going to do the framing a little slower so you see this better. Now I have the chance here of really seeing where the needle is going to be in the frame itself or on the material. Again in the middle I can either go faster or slow it down. That is how you do it on the machine itself. I like for you to see here now how you do this on the controller itself. What the controller does. I will hit the green button again. You'll notice that here's the center of design. It's very important where the center cross is and how it was digitized. I will hit the green button and you notice that the arrow moves up and down and across on the outside corners of the design itself. It will come back down towards the middle here and go right back up to the center of the design. That is how you arrange your design properly in a hoop. I'm okay with what I've done. As soon as I press the previous button or exit button out of there, the needle comes back up and we're ready to embroider. Remember one thing, you may need to change the needle colors here to adjust to your machine. Always double check that. And we are actually ready now to embroider this particular design on the ZSK TA2 controller and the Sprint 5 unit.